Welcome back to Spec Ops The Line. There was a little editing because I was so frustrated with something else. Got sidetracked, so I died a lot in this beginning part. Here comes more of them. Okay, gotta re up. So, if you're new, go to part one and they will explain everything. Uh, this could be a short commentary. So, no more deaths. Hey, we'll see part nine tonight. Because this is part eight. And it's about eight minutes long. And I will really enjoy this game. Like I said, I always say always. Got one. And this is part eight, if you want to, because it's part nine. Part 9 is tonight, part 8 is now. And I got a 3DS, but don't expect anything from that. And if you like this video, really, hit the like button. Wait, this video, post a comment, tweet me. It'd be in the description if you don't count, count and do. And this is it uh, for the commentary. So, hope you enjoy Spec Ops The Line Part 8. See you in the next part.
Holy shit. Did you guys see that psycho with the knife? Yeah, he was pretty damn hard to miss. Keep an eye out for anyone like him. A guy like that can fuck you up. Come on, through the building. Radio man running the show, it's not that hard to believe. How you figure? I actually think I met him once. In Kabul. He was a reporter traveling to the 33rd. Weird guy. Kind you didn't want loose in a firefight. Never spoke to him, but the colonel trusted him completely. Couldn't figure out why. Now it looks like that trust finally caught up with him. So what makes you think he's the same guy? Oh, it's his voice. You don't forget a voice like that. Signal still shit. We gotta go further down. Let's find a way out of here. Door up ahead. Gotta be the exit. 